we've got to really acknowledge that this uh, excessive use of uh, or waste of food rather than use of, of food that we don't need and we buy far more than we use before we go shopping get a list of what we're going to use don't, don't just buy it on the off chance that you might use it buy it with a purpose make a big difference to the amount of emissions that we have and really have a great impact on our carbon footprint I think it's got to be about what you buy I am as guilty of this as anybody. Uh, sometimes you might think you want to be super healthy, for example, so you buy loads more fruit and veg and then you're not able to use it. Um, so it's about being realistic when you go shopping, erring on the side of caution, but also if you do see that you've got too much food, you can cook it up and freeze it and then it doesn't need to go to waste. Also then, when you're having a tough day, it's handy there in the freezer to use. We should be very concerned about the amount of food that's going to waste. I think it's uh, really important that um, people begin to understand the link between the food that they waste and greenhouse gas emissions. And the fact that the less food we waste, we can lower our greenhouse gas emissions, which will have an impact on the climate. Um, so some research recently done by RAP shows that something like 81% of us are concerned about the climate, but only 37% of us realise the link between wasting food and greenhouse gas emissions. So alerting people to that is really important.